Twas the night before Christmas, when all through the house, not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care, in hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there. The children nestled all snug in their beds, while visions of sugar plums danced in their heads. And Mama in her kerchief and I in my cap had just settled our brains for a long winter's nap. When out on the lawn then arose such a clatter, I sprang from the bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave the luster of midday to objects below. When what to my wondering eye should appear but a miniature sleigh and eight tiny reindeer. With a little old driver so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be St. Nick. More rapid than eagles, his coursers they came, and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now Dasher, now Dancer, now Prancer and Vixen, on Comet, on Cupid, on Donder and Blitzen, to the top of the porch, to the top of the wall, now dash away, dash away, dash away all. And as dry leaves that before the wild hurricane fly, when they meet with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up to the housetop, the coursers they flew, when the sleigh full of toys and St. Nicholas too. As dry leaves that before the wild hurricane fly, when they meet with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up to the housetops, the coursers they flew, with a sleigh full of toys and St. Nicholas too. And then a twinkling I heard on the roof, the prancing and pawing of each little hoof. As I drew in my head and was turning around, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot, and his clothes were all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler just opening his pack. His eyes, though, how they twinkled, his dimples how merry. His cheeks were like roses and his nose like a cherry. His droll little mouth was drawn up like a bow, and the beard of his chin was as white as the snow. The stump of a pipe he held tight in his teeth, and the smoke it encircled his head like a wreath. He had a broad face and a little round belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. He was chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf, and I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work and filled all the stockings and then turned with a jerk and laying his finger aside of his nose and giving a nod up the chimney he rose. He sprang to his sleigh, to his team he gave a whistle, and away they all flew like the down of a thistle. But I heard him exclaim, ere he drove out of sight, Happy Christmas to all, and to all a good night. Hey, good morning, Thursday, December 21st, 2000. 23. It's the last day of the semester. Odd hour exams today. 216 dismissal. Yeah, yeah. Hey, over the, we had no uh, games last night. Two New Berlin athletes still up for primetime performer of the week on 1450. You can check that out. Go for vote for Jaden or Griffin Fox. We got a lot of tournament action over the holidays. Boys basketball at the IC shootout tomorrow night. And then they're at Waverly. Number two seed, still going to bring home a championship. We're going to see some other championships come home in wrestling at Abe's Rumble and Jacksonville Girls Tourney and the Southeast JV Invite. Girls basketball team, they've been hot. Uh, they're going to get it done over at Carlinville. And then junior high boys hoops are going to rock and roll at the Sangamon County Tournament as well. So get out and enjoy some sports over the holidays there are no birthdays today but there's a big one on december 25th and there is a manager's choice for lunch today 
Hey folks, have a Merry Christmas, a Happy New Year. Be good to each other. Be good to your family during the break and have a Merry Christmas.